A bag and valve mask can be used to assist patients with their ventilation if required, or to replace it if they have a respiratory arrest. Bag and valve masks are simple to use and often only require one person. They are composed of four parts, an oxygen hose feeding into the self-expanding reservoir bag, a mask and a one-way valve between the mask and bag. Before using the bag and valve mask, ensure the face mask is firmly attached to the end of the bag and valve and that to the other end you connect it to an oxygen supply running at 15 litres per minute. Then place the mask firmly over the patient's mouth and nose. Using your thumb and forefinger, apply downward pressure on the mask onto the patient's face and use your middle ring and little finger of the same hand to place under the angle of the patient's jaw, lifting the jaw into the mask. Using your other hand, squeeze the bag and you should observe the chest rise and fall. If this is not the case, try repositioning the mask and or your hands and try again. If this fails, try inserting an oropharyngeal airway if the patient will tolerate it. If you are still struggling to get a good rise and fall of the chest, use two hands to hold the mask as this will often give a better seal and ask a colleague to squeeze the bag for you.